Hey everyone, we're back with our math tip, and I have a special guest with me, a first grade fabulous teacher, Taylor Weaver. Hi everyone, my name is Miss Weaver, and I am a first grade teacher here at Sims Elementary. Today, we're gonna to be talking about introducing place value. Hey everybody, so today I wanted to focus on the concept of 10. So forever and always at this point in your first graders mathematical career, we have taught them that one means one. So when we're counting, we count and move one thing at a time. Always one. One cube means one space. So 10 cubes would be a group of 10. So here is where it starts to build. In first grade, we introduced the concept of one stick of 10. So now instead of having 10 individual things, we're telling them that we have one 10. This may seem like a simple task. However, children oftentimes have a misconception that when they get to double digit numbers, for example, the number 25, that this place is the tens place, so I have two tens. However, this is not just two. The value of this number is 20, and that begins with understanding one ten. So children have that misconception that 110 is now just one thing. This is not just one thing. Its value is still 10. So it's super important to have children building two digit numbers, especially in these younger grades. So I can have this 110, but I can also take it apart and make 10 ones and it equals the same Thing. They are equivalent. So on my mat right here, I have 20 ones. I have 20 ones, but this would also be equal to two tens. If I put these together, I would have two sticks of 10. This is super important when we get into the upper grades and we start regrouping and adding with triple digits. If students don't have this conceptual understanding that multiple things can now be grouped into one, they have a really hard time when we tell them to then take things away and move them around. Again, the most important tip for, that I have for you for today is building numbers. Kids need to see that I can take this apart and I can put it back together and they still have the same amount of cubes.